guys. Real quick, I have this little frog here I've used for a bunch of different things and I want to use just the frog in my next design. So I want to get rid of this lily pad and there are several ways to do it. One way I've seen folks do, if you didn't know, Lightburn has this option called cut shapes. So if I just draw a box across here and then I select all of this, go to tools, cut shapes, it's going to cut where the box was and then I can go in here and remove some of these nodes. Whoops, didn't I tell you guys not to hit the delete key but to hit the D to remove nodes? As you can see, I do it all the time too. Um, so we can go in and kind of clean this up and now that shape is removed. For me, that's the quickest way. The other thing you can do, if I undo all of this, you can also go in and do just a couple of quick boxes here, here. Let's go ahead and take our fill off, make it a line. And then I can go in here with my scissors. As long as everything is ungrouped, Jesse. I can cut here, over here, and cut here. Then I can go back in when I'm done and connect my nodes on the sides. It takes a little more time and practice to do it that way, but that is one other way you can, again, remove that lily pad that I don't want because I just want this frog. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I completely appreciate it. Let me know if you have any questions, and don't forget we do have a light burn boot camp coming up August 19th. Go to joneslasercraft.com to sign up. Hope to see some of your smiling faces there. Thanks so much.